Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, your boy Samson Biggs Boom here with another video. In this video, we're going to talk about Bitcoin and um, why it's pumping um, and where it's going to go from here. And should you be investing in Bitcoin? Will I be investing in Bitcoin? All that good jazz. So first things first, uh, you guys know that I have some some uh, um, uh, love hate thing going on with with crypto. Uh, I lost five grand in, in crypto about a year ago, maybe two years ago, no, something like that. I don't know, maybe I'll do two years ago, something like that. But that was my fault. I was doing stupid stuff. I was playing with uh, uh, crypto that I shouldn't have been playing with. Um, but uh, uh, but now I've that I've you know I've I've uh, I've done some soul searching and I've you know and I've done some studying and that's the most important thing. The most important thing is to to study, pay attention, and especially with crypto, you guys may come across crypto things that you know, like especially in the comments. Watch the comments and and be very skeptical of any comments that say like, you know, just mentions a coin that you've never heard of or anything like that. Even if you like go to whoever the commenter is. Like there's a, there's a, a scam going on right now about um, Amazon, an Amazon crypto coin that's supposed to be that supposed to be coming out, and um, it, it's not coming out. There's no there's no Amazon coin. Maybe in, maybe their Amazon is working on it, but whoever is doing this is a scam artist. And uh, if you click on the comment and you go to the the scam artist page. You'll see they have like a million followers and you're like a million subscribers and you're like, oh, this must be legit, but they must be fake uh, subscribers because you'll you'll lose all your money if you, you try and invest in this uh, fake one. But Bitcoin has been around the block. Bitcoin is now a part of the, it's part of the ether. It's part of everything. It's part of the, it's part of the financial nexus, right? Um, BlackRock, the biggest, you know, investment company out there, has uh, is investing in, in Bitcoin now. And Fidelity is investing in Bitcoin now. And most of these big brokerage houses are investing in, in, in Bitcoin. So with that being said, Bitcoin is back to where it was a, about, uh, let's see, in, uh, in January... Okay, we're hovering at about forty-seven thousand right now, um, and uh, you know, when they had the sell-off after the Bitcoin spot ETFs were approved, they had a little sell-off, and we dropped down to about thirty-nine thousand. Um, you know, this is this is the thing with Bitcoin is is it's very volatile and it moves up and down really fast. Um, but the biggest thing is. Bitcoin is going up. It's going up from here. It, it it's definitely pumping right now. Like I mean, it keeps trying to break through forty eight thousand, and it, it'll tap it, and then it goes back down. It'll tap forty eight thousand, and then it'll drop back down. It'll tap it and drop it back down. So I, you know, I'm I'm. It's it's on a little tear right now, and I think this is my my opinion, is that after. The sell everybody uh, sold off a few, you know, Bitcoin after the spot Bitcoin ETF went down. I think everybody was expecting that the moment that the spot Bitcoin ETF was approved, that was going to be instant skyrocket. And we had a little bit of sell off, so people were like, "Huh, that's weird." I thought it was going to blow up after this. It's still going to blow up. It's still blowing up right now. And it's pretty instant. Yes, there was a, a, about a month of, of, of you know, of, of pulling back. But then ever since, you know, January, it's January 25th. It's been just going up, going up. We had some consolidation between, you know, uh, the, uh, you know, the, the beginning of February. Uh, but then this in the last three days, it's just been phew, and I think we're going to hit 50,000 sometime this next week. Um, and then once it hits 50,000, you're going to get the FOMOing. 
uh, a lot of uh, a lot of people are gonna. I mean, a lot of people are foaming right now. I'm fomoing. <laughs> but I've I've set aside. What I do is I just invest a hundred dollars a week in Bitcoin. You know, I, I you know I don't. I, it's it's hard for me to play with it. So I just invest a hundred dollars a week in Bitcoin, uh, and try to do a hundred dollars a week in Ether, Ethereum. But Ethereum and Bitcoin are going to go up. You're going to see now that the spot Bitcoin ETFs are there, you guys, the big boys are in it. Once BlackRock got it in it, this is the thing. BlackRock is going to take over. Big bank take little bank. BlackRock is going to just keep on sucking in all the Bitcoin it can. Because they make money not just on Bitcoin, but they make money on their spot ETF, Right? That spot ETF is going to make them so much money. And so they're like, hey, look, we're going to take all that Bitcoin. We're going to take it all. You know, Fidelity doing the same thing. We're going to keep on taking it. Just And you're either going to invest in the spot Bitcoin ETF or you're going to invest in Bitcoin. Uh, you can invest in the miners too. Um, but that, that, that keeps it safe. Now, if you want to play the altcoins, that's up to you. I'm a little nervous with the altcoins, um, especially what happened what happened to me. So I think I'll just stick with Bitcoin and Ethereum um, and the miners. And, of course, the spot Bitcoin ETF. I'll, I'll get involved in that. Um, uh, I heard, now don't quote me on this, but I heard that Yieldmax is trying to push a an options ETF for Bitcoin. If that happens, whoa. You know what I'm saying? That's a big whoa if that happens. You know, because Yield Max is just doing, it's just killing the game, making me so much money. Uh, you know, and options. I'm learning options now too, so that way I can make some, some extra money on the sides. Um, but yeah, so Bitcoin's going to go up, guys. I suggest you just, if you're not 100% sold on Bitcoin by now, you know, I mean, it's not going to, it's not like, again, it's not too late either because Bitcoin is going to 100,000 100, for sure. For sure, it's going to 100,000. For sure, 100,000. Uh, after the halving, and the halving is in April. My birthday's in April. There's a sign. It's a sign. It's a sign. My birthday is April 18th. The Bitcoin having is April 18th. That's a sign, man. That's a sign. It's for me. <laughs> so maybe I'll invest a little bit more because it's my birthday and uh, and the Bitcoin having is going to happen on my birthday. So that's very exciting. Uh, so yeah, billionaire Samson is going to come true. <laughs> So I suggest, dude, just if you invest twenty dollars a week into Bitcoin and Ethereum, twenty dollars a week, you know, if you could do forty dollars a week, you know, twenty and twenty, that's great. If that's too much, just do twenty. Do ten and ten. Do ten Bitcoin, ten Ethereum, okay, and uh, just do it every week. Just add it in, add it in, add it in. Make just set it and forget it you know what i'm saying and then you will catch the upside as it goes up you know when bitcoin and maybe it takes a year but well, it's only 20 dollars a week you're not going to care about it i mean maybe you know hopefully if you're smart and you've been investing in yield max then you're making extra dividends that you could do that you know what i'm saying that's the whole point of these dividend income is that you could do it without dividend income you can't invest in other things right without the dividend income and your job income but the key word is income and this is the difference between growth stocks and income stocks right growth stocks they just grow but you don't got any income so you can't take them you have to sell them to take money to buy you know buy something else and i mean you could do that but it's better if you just get Income stocks. It's your boy Samson Biggs. Um, I'm excited about Bitcoin. I'm watching it. 
keeping a close eye on it, excited about Ethereum. Um, let, you, let me know what you guys think about Bitcoin and Ethereum and if you guys are investing in it. And with that being said, I will catch you on the next video. Billionaire. Billionaire Samson. Trillionaire Samson. One of the first trillionaires. Is there any trillionaires? I don't know. Maybe I'll be one of the first trillionaires. Okay? You gotta visualize it. You gotta visualize it. You gotta visualize it.